everybody, this is Ingrid here, and this is uh, not an episode of the Ingrid Car Chronicles. We don't know what we're going to call this particular one yet, um, but this is going to be launched on the Ingrid Hair Inspiration um, YouTube channel until we can find something that will have, you know, our, our vehicle, our vehicle to send our messages. Now I'm here with Bob Scullion. Number one. Yep. His nickname is Number One. Okay, so Bob, we're, we're, this is kind of off the cuff. We don't yeah. really, we haven't picked um, the subject matter for today. I think we have. Oh, have we? I forgot it already. Remember, okay. we had an earlier conversation today. Oh, I, sh that's right. Yeah. No, I don't remember. So, is there something I can take from memory? Oh yes, there's there's a lot of things you take from memory. Oh my God. Okay. Can we just listen? let's let's do a short one. Let's talk right. about memory. Yeah. Let's okay. Do that. What can what can what can I do to be more um, I guess proactive uh, yes, in, yes, in, in, in yes. my memory. So, yes. go ahead. So, so the whole key that we want to keep in mind is we don't want to be sitting. We want to be moving. Got it. When we're moving, we get the blood flowing in our body, and it affects our whole body. Right. Right. Okay. And including the brain. Right. Yeah. So when you're sitting, when you're sedentary, mm -hmm. you're sending a message to your brain that you don't need any more energy. Whoa. When you get moving. Your, your brain knows that you need energy. Right. And it, it stimulates the brain. And that fogginess you're talking about, right. with movement, there's more blood flow. Okay. So number one. Yes, okay, so that's number one. Okay, so move. Yeah. Okay, number two, let's talk about um, what uh, I yes. could ingest to yes. have energy. Go ahead. We wanna, uh, the, one of the, the challenges we have is the fact that, for example, in the case of Alzheimer's, mm -hmm. it's considered type 3 diabetes, Whoa. which is related to your blood sugar. Right. So when it comes to diet, we want to train our body to move from using carbohydrates as a sor energy source to using fats as an energy source. So, oh, yes, and okay. it, it can be done. So we want to select healthy fats. Right, healthy fats. And okay, healthy fats are going to send a message that we're using, or we're using fats as a fuel source instead of carbs. Okay. Remember, carbohydrates turn into sugar. Right. And remember that sugar is a component and a cause of Alzheimer's because Alzheimer's is actually type 3 diabetes. Whoa. So there's a connection between the blood sugar and cognitive disrepair. Those, My those two right. things are really, you know. So when you say disrepair, does that mean it cannot be repaired? No, everything is reversible. Okay. Oh, did you hear that? Oh, everything is reversible. I mean, that, that, that's, I have to say, that's, that's probably, those are probably words of like a, a lark to many people in the world today who are just in the world that have lived. I mean, I mean, anybody could say that if you've lived and I'm 50 years old, it's like, I mean, I've been, you know, I've done it all. Well, not really all, but I mean, you know, I've been bad to my body. I've been good to my body. I've been indifferent. I mean, there's haven't drank any water, et cetera. So the mm -hmm. fact that there's we have there's hope, mm -hmm. right, yeah. to turn things around is, right. is a blessing. So right. that's amazing. So basically, yes. we there's a sh there's a connection. Yes, there right? is. Yes, there to is. The Alzheimer's that you know where you're for forgetful. So if I cut out the sugar, beef up the protein. Yes. And get my ass moving. I'm right. good to go. Right, right, exactly. Okay. So let's talk about before you move into action, mm -hmm. what is paramount is checking our beliefs. Mm. What kind of beliefs are we holding? Right. If we have a belief that we are stuck, that we have a sentence that there's nothing we can do to alter our experience, that's what's going to happen in our life. Right. Yeah. Because that kind of belief is fed into your subconscious and it comes into effect. Mm. But... The good news is we can change our beliefs each and every moment, Ingrid. Oh, yes. Right. Each and every moment, we're born new. Mm -hmm. We have moments of clarity in each moment. I, so what we're inviting all of us to do is to examine those beliefs. Right. Do you hold a belief that you're aging? Do right. you have a belief that you are less than vibrant and healthy? You can change that belief. Right. It's not permanent. It's not stuck. It's, right. it's fluid. Yes. And that's the power we have. We can empower ourselves and realize that every action we take is an action of self-love. Yes. We're loving ourselves with each choice. We're not condemning ourselves or criticizing ourselves.
for what's happened in the past because that's that's done. that's right, right that's right. brought us to this present moment right. ingrid right this beautiful present moment and that's, it is a beautiful and we are is. creative beings yes we're we're deliberate creators yes. and we can create anything we want exactly exactly and even sometimes i say to myself i'll step back and i'll and i'll look at i'll look at my surroundings and i'll go huh i created all of this yes and i, I all of it you and also i'll kick back and i'll be like so do you like what you created you know, are you like, yes, good job? Or are you like, oh shit, right? And um, and, and if I, it is oh shit, I'm like, okay, so what what can we recreate mm -hmm. or, or create again? Maybe not even so much recreate, because there's more to do. Yes. Right? Um, not beating myself up, no. that, right? But being like, okay, so what, what positive step am I going to make? It's all about, right. you know, we're not victims here. No, we're, we're creators. Not. We're, we're, we're artists. We're, we are artists. We're geniuses. Yes. Okay, so I, I love everything that you've said to I me. I know, I know. Um, this is all powerful. I will, I'll write down the, the three things, the yes. three main things. Yes. But that, that doesn't mean that that's the only three things that we can do to help our our brains or you know remem re remembering but I will put those three things in the uh, link below uh, on this Facebook post or not Facebook but uh, YouTube and um, then you know ways to get a hold of me ways to get hold of Bob and yeah. you know just so you can be in connect in um, in connection with us um, for, with any questions that yes. they have yes. that we will answer and like I said this is our first or second video because this would actually be the second yeah to our first yeah yeah and many more to come and hopefully we can um, uh, you know this will who knows what's going to happen, but I would like to create yes. something that, you know, we, that would, would be structured. Yes. All about health and wellness. Yes. Anti-aging. Okay. Because to be honest with you, I am committed to actually getting younger, actually reversing. Well, you are. You right? are getting so, younger. So it's like, oh, wow, my knee hurts. All of a sudden, I'll start waking up in the morning and I'm like, woo, let's go, right? So I'm actually going to become younger. You'll watch me you become are. younger. You are. You and are. And I am. Already. There you are. Already. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Yes. Thank you. I want to close the comment. Yes. Since we were talking about beliefs, I'd like to share with you something that was inspiring to me. Uh, it's uh, a book about the subconscious, and his name is Joseph Murphy. And so check him out, and he's written many books, and he will really be a great companion for you as you're recalibrating and restructuring your belief system as you're examining the beliefs you're carrying with you which of those do you want to discard which would you like to embrace nice. and the choice is yours but jo joseph murphy would be a great companion for you in those moments where you forget right he'll just he's a great companion he will remind you and he's been very ins inspirational for me I love that. Yeah. That's wonderful. Yeah. Okay, we'll say goodnight. Bye. Good night. We'll see you until we uh until we see you again.